Well, I play the red herring character of Jake, I guess. <laughs> Why are we here? Well, I'm the guy in the movie that you're not quite sure about from the beginning to the, the denouement at the end. I'm the one that should keep you guessing, hopefully, if I do my job. The, the most pleasant aspect, and this is a tribute to Wes, is that because he's so calm at the center of the storm, it is a, an extremely relaxed and pleasant set. There, I haven't been witness to a single day of yelling or egos or, or, or even a minor hiccup in the day. I mean, we shoot, we get what we, done, what we need to get done, done, and that's it. And there's no need for histrionics. And that's an unbelievably pleasant atmosphere to go in and do your work because at that point you don't have to worry about stepping on people's toes or worry about the environment that you're in. You just go and do it. And if it's not right, he tells you, you do it differently. If it is, he said, good, and then we go home. They're fun. And when they're done right, there, it's an absolutely enjoyable way to go and spend two and a half hours and to laugh and, and scream and you know maybe take your girlfriend. She has to cuddle into your arms because she's scared. It's a good date movie, and it does you know it, when it when it's not insulting, when it's not pandering to the audience, and you don't feel like someone's been making fun of you on screen for two hours. You can go and enjoy it and you know throw popcorn at the screen when the bad guys are on screen and, and cheer for the good guys. And I love movies like that, popcorn movies. Yeah, <laughs> that's the fun of my job. Now, when we finish here today, which is my last day, then the next great joy I'm going to take out of this movie is be sitting in a dark room with everybody and getting scared just like everybody else. I think they will, yeah. From what, I, from what I've seen of the beast, you will be terrified. <laughs>